robots.txt is a programming file which indicates a crawler to identify the full website pages. robot.txt indicates to a crawler to crawl a website. It's also known as robots exclusion protocols which identify which parts is necessary to get indexed by robot.txt. Robot.txt cannot identify the duplicate contents and the website pages which are under development or under construction. It also identify the malwares and weakness for a websites. A complete robots.txt file includes user agent and allow disallow services. It also includes the automatic information and if you try to write it manually then you will be need huge times. Robots.txt is very much important SEO for whitehead SEO or for search engine indexing. Sometimes search engine likes to get indexed by robots.txt. Sometimes search engines likes to get indexed by sitemap.xml formation. If you do not have robots.txt on your website pages on the domain root section, then you will miss important search engines algorithm for your websites. Like you will not get desired number of traffics, you will not get desired number of visits, you will not get expected, expected number of expected number of sales leads or signups this is very much necessary seo functions for any website today we will discuss with you about to create robots.txt by a robots.txt generator seo tool or seo software from a small seo tools you will find this video on my youtube tutorial playlist small seo tools sections I have prepared some more small SEO tools related video tutorials which are very much important for the SEO learners, SEO beginners, SEO experts, SEO service sellers or SEO skills experts. By learning this process you and you can also offer your buyers or clients that you are eligible to create the robots.txt file and you are eligible to create robots.txt file for any complete websites and you can list your services to the several marketplaces like i can say you can list your services to the world largest seo marketplace named seo clerks if you are new on my youtube channel you will find the world largest seo clerks related seo marketplace video tutorials on my youtube channel homepage that is the name is SEO class by one term registration you will get seven to eight marketplace access login you can register minimum five services with every every marketplace websites on your specific category all marketplaces are are related to the whitehead SEO services and this is the world largest whitehead SEO marketplace I guess minimum 1 million sellers are selling 5 million services on this SEO related marketplaces. If you are new on my YouTube channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon so that you cannot miss any videos from my YouTube channel at the future time. I often upload videos about SEO, whitehead SEO, SEO marketplace, SEO services or SEO skills. So friends, ho I hope you will subscribe on my YouTube channel and if you like any videos, do not forget to share. If you like any video, to, if, you, if you have any suggestion for any video, do not forget to comment also. And you can share it, you can share my YouTube channel or any video with your, social, with your popular social media like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. LinkedIn, Emo, WhatsApp, any popular social media or messenger you use, you can share my YouTube channel over there. And you, anybody who is new on my YouTube channel, he can learn SEO, vast SEO, on-page SEO, off-page SEO, technical SEO related services, uh, technical SEO related details, and he can prepare 
SEO functions for his websites or he can sell the services on the world largest popular marketplaces also. In robots.txt file, you can write several lines in, you can line several commands in online. We will see the details within the desktop video recording section, how to create a robots.txt by small SEO tools generator, which touches, which will touch the major search engines around this world. At first, search engine searches robots.txt file on your website. If it if does not find, there have massive chance to exclude your websites from search engine databases. For robots.txt file, Google have a budget and Google have a crawl limit. Crawl limit means the number of times a crawler spent in your website. You cannot add main pages in case of disallowed services because if Google crawler does not find the main pages of your website, he cannot index your website in the search engine databases. If Google finds the your website is checking the user experience, then Google bots will crawl your website slower. slower. It means every time Google sends a spider to your website, it will only check a, checking, checks the few, few pages of your website and will take huge time to, uh, to, to get indexed with the new post or new post images or new post descriptions. To remove this restriction from your website for the lifetime, you need two files that is one is called robots.txt and second is called sitemap.xml the previous video uh, on this video previous video i have there have a video about sitemap.txt you can sitemap.xml you can check those video a to z i will share that video at the top of the video at the last of the video and with the video descriptions also uh, you will find that video with the small seo tools playlist tutorials and i will also share the seo class related video tutorials at the top of the video last of the video and at the uh, with these video descriptions. Robots.txt and sitemap.xml will speed up your website much in case of search engine search when anyone searching your by keyword or keywords or keywords or keyword phrases then Google will try to show your website very much speedy way. So friends we will see the robots.txt creating process on the desktop recording section I'm requesting you to increase the volume of your devices like of, of your laptop or mobile and you can you can get some lower volume from my video recording section and we will see the full details within the video recording section let's go to the desktop recording section okay we are already within the screen let's see this is my youtube channel home page you can see the muscle bcl msud bcl and after that you will find this youtube payment proof related video tutorials if you want to earn from youtube monetization program this video playlist tutorial will help you a lot you can check this full video tutorial playlist and the second option you can check the small seo tools this playlist tutorials small i i always prepare small SEO tools related video tutorials and you can see those small SEO tools SEO tools or SEO softwares online SEO tools online SEO softwares online free SEO tools and free SEO softwares I have been using this website for the last 10 years and I got huge benefits from this website and SEO class related English tutorial you will find in here let's go to the uh, small, small SEO tools here you will find the small SEO tools and after coming small SEO tools, you will find the you will find that list about robots.txt. Let's see where is it present. Robots.txt. Robots.txt. You will find this. There is a file is called robots.txt generator. Here have some fewer videos. Uh, fewer videos are tools are available. Website management tools. I have prepared some videos on here also about these tools also and I have a full list of video tutorials about backlinks tools backlinks tools 
and I have a full tutorials about keyword tools, keywords tools. So friends, here you will find that website management tools. Website management tools is called you will find robots.txt, robots.txt generator. When you click on here, you will find this robots.txt. And you need to you need to go down for creating a robot.txt. Default all robots are all robots are allowed any kind of robots which are available within the internet those are allowed default no delay no delay is called default no delay that means quicker index you can take five seconds ten seconds 120 seconds you can check time breaks and everybody selection default no delay and sitemap a leap blank if you don't have if you do not have sitemap then you can leap blank and if you have sitemap then you can give the website address over here I have provided the website addresses on here musclebcl.xyz slash sitemap.xml I have previously previously designed it and this is the search robots Google Google image Google mobile Amazon search Yahoo Yahoo MM Yahoo blogs ask Yahoo blogs ask.tioma giga blast demo jet checker nance Alexa Alexa Webeck and Baidu never MSN pick search. Baidu is good. And you will see this code also on here, rest restricted directories, uh, ICGI slash bin. If you do not allow any pages or any directories or any folder, uh, you can, you can, this path is relative to root and must contain a trailing slash. It's called the slash double S. The programmer can easily identify this. I am not, uh, I am not huge expert about this matter and you can create the create robots.txt like click on here create robots.txt small as your tools is asking you create robots.txt file txt files and he will give you a file that is called robots.txt generated by small as your tools user as in diesel or diesel or cgf sitemap this is. though i have created a sitemap so i i got a small lines on here but if i want to get large lines then i can Let's see the site accept sitemap options. Uh, what type of file file they give? Create robots.txt. Create robots.txt. This giving same. And if I want to specific on the search engine says set as div same as default, like allowed, allowed, and allowed. Amazon search allowed. Yahoo allowed. Yahoo mm allowed. Yahoo blogs allowed. This one is allowed. Every search engine. So then this will give as their programmatic function some kinds of uh, this robot.txt works as a disallow service. If you select allow, he will show as a result of disallow. And if you select disallow, he will show as a result as a allowed. Let's see the create.robot, create robot.txt. Okay. And he saved the follow. Is rather than disallow, is rather than Google disallow, but you have to put all of the data. It's called uh, export robot.txt, or you can copy on here. Like I have created, I have a blogger website, I have a blogger website, and there I want to put this robot.txt file. Then you need to go to the settings, settings from settings, you have to come to the search preference. You have to come to the search preference, and there you will find an option that is called robots.txt. That is called robots.txt. Let's find it out search description and it's called robo custom robots.txt and you can put up that code over here custom.robots.txt and one here uh, additionally you can use this code to wordpresses also uh, this is small as your tools code work, works with everywhere the uh, the templates you are using i am using blogger templates for that reason it's it's the option from settings you will from settings you will go to the custom robots and then you will put the code i have prepared previously for that reason, I am not pasting the course over here. Okay, friends, we saw the full process about to create a robots.txt file for your website. And if you have a website, you .com, .org, .education, .net, or anything .x, .info, .store, then you need to create must a robots.txt and sitemap.xml file. What is the difference be between sitemap.xml and robots.txt file? Basically, sitemaps indicates the updates of your websites regularly to the search engines or search engines databases, like which contents you have updated lastly. A sitemap 
always indicate always searches a uh, site map site maps robots site maps scholars site map bots always check the websites every inches and always update the last descriptions text images and videos for search engines databases on the other hand robotics.txt file is a crawler it works for the search engines to collect the information from the websites a sitemap is necessary whereas your website for getting index but it's not possible for robotics the robots.txt file index is a one of the major things on this internet search engine submission sections because if you do not submit your website to the world largest search engines and to the world wide directories then your websites will miss important number of traffics which are getting generated by the search engines or which are getting generated by the online directories one of the submission processor process is called sitemap.txt so if sitemap.xml and if your websites have good sitemap.xml if your website have good robotics.txt file then both will work good for your content to get updated with search engines or search engines directories or search engines databases sometimes some professional websites or directories only show the listed results first so if you works regularly with the internet search engine submission then there you will you will be additionally need these two files one is sitemap.xml and another is robots.txt file these two these two links these two links will help you ultimately to get good rank to get good num to collect to, to get good index with the website directories and to collect good number of traffics visitors and sales leads or signups also if you search on google free website submission free site submission free url submission free link submission then you will find huge you will use online directories there you can list your websites and sometimes some directories can ask you about sitemap.xml file extension link or robots.txt file extension link remember about this sitemap.xml always indicates the files new files new product new description new image links to the search engines or search engines direct search engines directories or search engine databases where robots.txt works as a crawler robots.txt is the most powerful crawler who cross the websites for by sitemap.xml to add with search engines or search engines databases so if you are new on my youtube channel or if you come at the middle of my youtube channel you are requested to subscribe and press the bell icon so that you cannot miss any videos from my youtube channel at the future time i oftenly prepare video about small about seo tools seo softwares online seo tools online seo software free seo tools free seo softwares and you can learn from those soft, uh, from those video tutorials easily and you can sell your skill to the world largest marketplaces like a small seo like uh, like seo clerks or any other marketplaces which you like if you need any of my help uh, if you want to contact with me or if there have any of video you want to upload with my youtube channel or if you have any seo software seo services you want to focus by my youtube channel you are requested to contact with me by my about section uh, you have to go to my youtube channel homepage. there you will find about section and from about section you will find the, my email address and all of my social media links and you can contact with any social media or with my email directly I will also share my SEO class related level X4 X4 profiling with this video descriptions. You can contact with me SEO class marketplace profile also by coming to my SEO class profile. You can register free as a buyer or as a seller and then you can place a custom order or you can send me messages also. So friends, hope you had enjoyed the video. You learn a new SEO and talk to you a new video. Talk to you and talk to you, you on the next video with a new SEO function. Till then, check it.